Hello, and welcome to today's video presentation on running uptrack commands online mode on Oracle Linux 8. In this video, we demonstrate how to utilize the uptrack commands to handle online kernel patching tasks on Oracle Linux 8. The uptrack commands are the executables for the Oracle KSplice uptrack client. System administrators use this command to perform various kernel KSplice update tasks manually. So let us get started. Open a terminal to your system running Oracle KSplice. All uptrack commands require elevated privileges, so execute using sudo. For help on the uptrack command, see the uptrack man page by typing man uptrack. Uptrack helps manage KSplice rootless kernel updates. The first sample will display KSplice updates already applied to the running kernel. Type sudo space uptrack dash show. As this is a fresh install, there are no updates installed and displays the effective kernel. With no patches applied, the effective kernel will match the output of the Linux command uname space dash r. Next, get a list of the available updates. Type the command sudo space uptrack dash upgrade space dash n. You can also get the same information by typing sudo space uptrack dash show space dash dash available. Since there are patches available, apply them by typing sudo space uptrack dash upgrade space dash y. Once the updates are applied, this will update the effective kernel version. Type sudo space uptrack dash uname space dash r to display the effective kernel version. Notice that this is a newer kernel version than the output from uname space dash r. This series of commands display the kernel updated on the live system. Although KSplice allows rebootless kernel updates, Oracle recommends as part of best practices regularly completing a sudo space dnf space upgrade to patch the on-disk kernel and other packages. To remove the KSplice updates, type sudo space uptrack dash remove space dash dash all. Based on your kernel case by settings in forward slash etsy forward slash uptrack forward slash uptrack dot conf, Oracle case splice will reapply updates after a system reboot. To prevent this from happening and temporarily disabling Oracle case splice, create an empty file forward slash etsy forward slash uptrack forward slash disable by typing sudo space touch space forward slash etsy forward slash uptrack forward slash disable. To enable Oracle case splice again, remove the file by typing sudo space rm space forward slash etsy forward slash uptrack forward slash disable. Alternatively, you can specify the no uptrack argument as a boot parameter during a system reboot. That completes this video coverage of Oracle case splice uptrack. Thank you for watching this video and enjoy exploring the benefits of Oracle case splice. Additional information is available on KSplice and other Linux topics in the Oracle Linux 8 documentation or Oracle Linux Learning Library.